Hello everybody, welcome to a new series of tutorials on drum computer from Sugarbytes. Um, before I start, I have a couple of codes to give away. So if you are interested, if you'd like to enter the competition to win a copy of drum computer, just follow the instruction contained in the video description and also check on the comments section that the competition is still uh, alive because it might be closed if you see winners informed on the top comment. It is also uh, useful for you to keep um, um, coming back, per, for example, the, the following day to check if uh, you won because uh, I will be leaving a comment to uh, to people which have won, um, to subscribers which have won. So just check your comment to see if you have uh, uh, won indeed the competition, if you enter of course. So in this first video uh, of the series, I'm going to go through a little bit of the interface, just an introduction to drum computer. It is a fantastic uh, drum machine. It's really feature rich with a lot and lot of functionalities, really very well laid out, as you can see. It's really fantastic to see uh, the um, drum machine available on iOS now. It has eight synth engines, which you can see also here, in one, two, eight. You have um, three different synth layers. So you have a resonator here, a wavetable analog, and also a resynth sampler with a lot of effects. As you can see, you have EQ, distortion, cutoff, and you have a lot of sources when it comes to modulation. So really, really cool. So as I mentioned, eight um, different synth engine, you click on each one here to listen to the particular uh, sound. A global volume, which is always better to reduce in order to re remove some clipping. The sound quality is really amazing. You can also make your uh, kit. You can randomize, of course, pretty much everything. Refill patterns. So it's really, really quite cool. You can also do remixing if, here with this ribbon bar as well, which I'll show you in a second. Um, you can change settings for your kit, like DK, or also modify um, in manual mode modulation. Here you have, for example, master effects, which you can change as well. You have a sequencer on board as well. And here you have 16 tracks, you can um, play them uh, following one direction or different direction, you can randomize them as well. You can change the randomization of velocity, probability, rolls as well, modulation. You can also change map effectively to your keyboard, for example, changing of patterns, but also playing uh, different sounds as well, which is really cool. And you can also chain patterns as well. So really, really feature rich. So let's play this button and um, just to give you an example on what it sounds like. Let's try a different one. As you can see, a lot of presets, really preset for each and definitely worth um, to go for uh, um, uh, the in a purchase, really, really worth it. Look, you can come uh, customize your kit as well as a present here. 
make the changes and I press these a couple of times as I'm playing the pattern. So really, really cool. Let's um, try another um, preset and let's adjust again uh, the global volume. So as you can see and as you can hear, really a fantastic app. So we are going to go through control by control. We're going to go through all the different settings uh, for each of the sound engines and also layers in uh, the next tutorial. And again, to show you a couple of capability here, you can change, you can load different samples. You can also import them as well for your wavetable. And um, same here on the sampler. So lots and lots of features which we will explore in the next video hope you enjoy see you next time bye